Hello, I'm Spade. It's been a while since we've checked in on my deathmatch playing, and I've been playing deathmatch, but frankly I've been playing it a fair amount less than I used to be, since I've been spending so much time in matchmaking and on ESEA. I have to admit, playing competitive is pretty damn fun, even compared to deathmatch. Maybe especially compared to deathmatch, I don't know. So, when I first started tracking headshots per kill and headshots per minute, that was the fourth uh, episode, I guess, of Mastering CSGO that I did. And my headshots per kill at that time was 0 0.59. My headshots per minute was 1.28. This last go-around, I had a 0 0.61 headshots per kill ratio and a 0 0.81 headshots per minute ratio. So I started looking for excuses, and I found out that I was in a server with Skadoodle and Volcano. And yes, that was a one-shot headshot on Skadoodle, which is probably the proudest achievement I've ever made. Uh, he didn't take long to get his revenge, though. Other than that, as an excuse, I started kind of looking around to see, well, can I at least see some difference? Can I see some improvement? Can I see that I've been making progress, even if the statistics don't necessarily reflect it from this round? Because everybody has up days and down days. So I found some of this footage here which is me playing Deathmatch on February 17th. So, a little more than two months ago. And as I watch it, I realize that my movement has changed a lot. My familiarity with the map and the game has improved a lot. Uh, I, I sat through several minutes of this and it was actually, it's sort of, it's almost painful to watch in some cases. It's like, okay, well, well, hurry up, or, you know, my movements seem so slow, my reactions seem very slow. Um, it, it seems like I don't always necessarily know where to look. Um, for some weird reason, there are situations like this where it's like, I, I really should be dead. Um, and, you know, there it goes, but it, it took a little longer than, than I would have expected it to take. Um, I do a lot of sort of standing around in open spaces, um, but I get my headshots. So, you know, I don't know. But if you compare my movement here in this clip to, you know, the movement that I have today when I'm moving around Dust 2, so let's go back to modern times, um, I, I see a lot more rapid movements. I see a lot more um, crosshair placement in, you know, areas where people are likely to show up, um, which is good. Uh, it's not perfect by any means. And uh, clearly I have a lot to do, but uh, I do feel a little bit more satisfied. I feel like I actually did have some improvement, even though uh, the statistics are not there yet. Uh, I'll check in again as we get closer to the three-month deadline that I set for myself uh, when I started out and see what three months of, of deathmatch play can really do to your statistics. Spade out.